Come here immediately, let's learn online. Adverbs, in general, are words that modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. Adverbs provide additional information about the action or event being described, such as when, where, how, or to what extent it occurs. Where is your homework? Right here, teacher. Why did you give it to me just now? It was assigned two weeks ago. I have no excuse, I just forgot about it. There are several types of adverbs in English, including the following. Adverbs of frequency. These indicate how often an action or event occurs, such as always, usually, often, sometimes, rarely, never, and occasionally. Always like that one. Sometimes after work I go to the park and feed the birds. I mean, I never thought I would have an experience like this ever in my life. Adverbs of manner. These indicate the way in which an action or event occurs, such as quickly, slowly, loudly, gently, beautifully, badly, and carefully. Quickly, 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 talk very, very quickly. Adverbs of time. These indicate when an action or event occurs, such as yesterday, now, later, early, soon, and already. Yesterday, he canceled the Fremont game. Adverbs of place. These indicate where an action or event occurs, such as here, there, above, below, inside, outside, and nearby. And let's turn it around, do inside, outside the foot. Adverbs of degree. These indicate the extent or intensity of an action or event, such as very, extremely, completely, totally, almost, slightly, and partially. Oh, it's totally fine. I completely understand. Adverbs of certainty. These indicate the degree of certainty of an action or event, such as certainly, definitely, surely and undoubtedly. You are definitely going to Philly. Adverbs of affirmation or negation. These indicate the affirmation or negation of an action or event, such as yes, no, not and never. Yes. Yes, yes. 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 Adverbs of reason or purpose. These indicate the reason or purpose of an action or event, such as therefore, hence, thus and so. Yep, I think therefore I am. Adverbs of concession. These indicate the degree of concession of an action or event, such as although, though, even though and despite. Affirmative yes, although we have a problem. Adverbs of contrast. These indicate the contrast of an action or event, such as but, however, nevertheless and yet. Nevertheless, I don't think your idea of having him followed is very practical. No? Adverbs can be used in different positions within a sentence, which depends on the type of adverb being used, and the emphasis that is being placed on the action or event being described.